I'm one of a kind, there ain't no one like me So I define, it's the real damn thing Don't be wasting any time, I got somewhere to be Always on the go You have to think he's got his sights set on SmackDown's Universal Champion. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Saxton. Let's just wait and see. We are now officially on the road to WrestleMania. Let's hear what WWE Champion Seth Rollins has to say after his little misstep on social media. His account was hacked. Part of being the Monday Night Messiah is being honest with your disciples. It's that trust, that bond that gives us strength and allows us to accomplish great things. So I'm here tonight to tell the truth about why I did what I did to show it was all for the greater good and still can be. So, I'll speak directly to our discontented brother, Messiah to man. First, let's get this out of the way. My social media account was not hacked. We did have intentions of striking you down if you chose to face me at WrestleMania. That's the truth. But full disclosure, there were other transgressions that took place before that. I told Mandy Rose that you didn't want an automatic qualifying spot in the Rumble, that you really wanted to earn it, which got you put in the 10-man qualifying match. That's the truth. And then, when you won that match, we needed another plan. So, I pulled some strings and got you the number two entry spot in the Rumble. And then, of course, we all know how that turned out and how we ended up here tonight. And all of that is the truth. So now, I've bared my soul to you and shown you everything. We can still work together. We can still do great things. Win the Universal Championship at WrestleMania, and we can take over WWE like we had planned. Or, you can ignore the truth, throw everything away, and take on the Monday Night Messiah and his disciples and face your destruction at our hands. Make no mistake, if you challenge us, we will finish the burial that I started. But remember, I was just trying to steer you toward the correct choice to help you succeed. And that's what I'm doing again now. But this is it. It's your last chance. Make the right decision. Honor the truth. And trust me for the greater good. Will the Royal Rumble winner listen to the Monday Night Messiah and put this all behind them? Or will he choose to take on Seth Rollins at WrestleMania? We'll find out soon enough. universe heard from Seth Rollins earlier tonight and we all want to know did his words have any impact on who you will face at Wrestlemania you might be wondering why I'm holding this shovel you see Seth likes to speak in metaphors and talk about all sorts of things like the greater good and embracing the truth <laughs> so I figured I'd speak his language Seth you and your disciples tried to bury me but you failed and now I'm gonna bury you at WrestleMania. That's right, I'm not changing my mind. But you know what? Why wait until WrestleMania? I'm gonna start the burial tonight by taking out your disciples in a three-on-one match. <laughs> Actually, I forgot about the shovel. Make that three-on-two. Rollins followers prepare for this three-on-one match against their former ally. You have to imagine their leader, the Monday Night Messiah, will be watching closely. 
With the odds heavily in their favor, Seth won't be satisfied with anything other than a convincing win. I think that's exactly what we're going to see here tonight. From behind with that shovel. He's not waiting for the match to start. It's no longer three on one. That shovel's an equalizer. He's taken out weeks of built up frustration after being held back by Seth and his group. He said he was going to bury Seth's followers, but I didn't know he meant it literally. I think Mustafa Ali and Austin Theory could have serious injuries. It doesn't appear that the scheduled match will take place. Seth's crew is decimated. Maybe, but it looks like Murphy still wants to fight. Poor decision on his part. This guy's out for vengeance. Nonetheless, it looks like we're now going to have a singles match. This superstar is coming in with a lot of enthusiasm and energy right now. But what's going to happen when the excitement wears off and he comes to realize he's in a fight against someone looking to take his head off? All I can say is we've seen adrenaline take this superstar very far in the past. Then there's Murphy across the ring, a man searching for recognition. A superstar who's trying to step out of the shadows and make a name for himself. Murphy may be overshadowed at times, but make no mistake about it. Murphy's a wildly talented competitor with a chip on his shoulder and fire in his lungs. Neckbreaker! Hit the rope. Oh, running knee strike. If this lands, it might be all over. So Chosen one, AJ! What an emphatic victory, guys. No contest. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Championship. Yeah, now we're talking. Well, the Messiah has arrived. It is time to embrace the vision. Introducing the challenger from St. Louis, Missouri. Weighing in at 220 pounds, the chosen one, AJ! And introducing the champion from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, he is the WWE Champion, Seth Rollins! The stakes could not be any higher. It is time for our WWE Championship match.
The road to WrestleMania has led to this. The defending WWE Champion Seth Rollins will take on his former associate, a superstar who some have called the Grave Digger, due to his vicious pledge to bury Seth Rollins once and for all in tonight's no DQ WWE Championship match. One of WWE's most fearsome alliances has been shattered by the quest for this WWE Championship, Michael. You have to wonder how those betrayals will affect the outcome of one of the most personal WrestleMania main events we've seen in years. You're talking about Murphy, Austin Theory, and Mustafa Ali, aren't you, Byron? That's right. They've all got something on the line tonight in what should be an absolutely brutal no disqualification format. Listen, sometimes the only road to WrestleMania is the low road. Seth Rollins and his opponent know that, but only one of them will leave WrestleMania as champion. Reversal on top of reversal. Super Kid finds the mark. Trap. This will not end well. This is not going to be good. Relentless. Seth Rollins' chances are whittling down. This can't be how Rollins envisioned his night going. Oh my God. Tommy Musso. Oh, the moonsault connects. Fortune favors the bold. These risks could be a winning strategy. Man. Strikes! Wow! Wrench in the arm. Pele kick. It, it looks like, yeah, guys. Hold on, it's Seth Rollins' disciples. Well, last we knew, they weren't medically cleared to be here. Looks like they're going to get revenge for what was done to them on Raw with that shovel. Never underestimate the Monday Night Messiah. We should have known he wasn't going into this match without a backup plan. I know there's been a lot of turmoil between these men, and this is no disqualification, but this is WrestleMania. It's not supposed to end like this. This is going to get ugly. I can't watch. What the hell? What just happened? He hit Seth with a stomp. Could this be it? He's done it. After a shocking turn of events where former allies turned enemies became allies again, Seth Rollins has been dethroned, and we have a new WWE Champion. And more than a new champion, it looks like we have a new alliance with a new leader. I think we just saw the birth of a new Monday Night Messiah. And Seth Rollins can't believe it. He thought he acted his WWE, but that was not the case. The new champion set out to bury him, and that is exactly what he just did. This is a WrestleMania moment that will be remembered for a very long time. I'm in shock. Wow, uh, congrats to the new champion, I guess. This is going to be good.
Well, the Messiah has arrived. It is time to embrace the vision. Introducing the challenger from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, Seth Rollins! And introducing the champion from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the WWE Champion, the Chosen One, AJ! It is the richest prize our industry has to offer. This is the WWE Championship. Tonight, the Monday Night Messiah will preach his gospel from inside a steel cage as he tries to win back his title from the newly minted WWE Champion, who has proven time and time again he may very well be the most powerful man in all of WWE. There's nothing like strength in numbers, Michael, and the WWE Champion has that in spades with three new disciples in his corner. I just don't see a world where Murphy, Austin Theory, and Mustafa Ali don't find a way to get involved tonight, lock cage or not. Yeah, yeah, everyone in the WWE Universe has been talking about the shovel heard round the world at WrestleMania, but the reality is the new WWE Champion has been the man to beat all by himself. Pele kick. Seth Rollins desperately needs to figure this out. Rollins has to devise a new plan. Oh my, oh my, what elevation. The challenger not looking good right now. Honestly, considering this is a cage match, I'm surprised it took this long for the damage to pile up. And oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Stomping down. He's running into some problems here, guys. Yeah, this can't be how we picture this fight going. Yes, press! Running Swanton finds the mark. Super kick from the King Slayer. Looking for a grip to get themselves over. Cage. Both the left. Oh my gosh, what impact. Look out below. And he hits the map with a thud. Yeah, he's going to have to try something else now. Rawls dodges in the nick of time. As he finds his footing. to dust to the champ. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Oh, lights out. It's always disorienting taking those hits above the shoulders. Here's a combo of strikes. Man, right to the face. Rollins getting worked on here. And Rollins in need of salvation. Impressive reversal on Rollins. Oh, man, that was nasty. Well scattered reversal there. Caught the leg. Knee right to the face. This will turn your lights out in a hurry. Driver. Now that is why they're the champ. Right in the mouth, relentless. Enough already. The face of Seth Rollins looks like it's been through a wood chipper. And now he's producing some overwhelming offense. Yeah, he is staying steady and ferocious. And he's been concentrated on that area throughout this one. He knows every blow there weakens his opposition more each time. This will 
turn your lights out in a hurry. We might need medical personnel out here very soon. I agree with you. The referee can only diagnose so much. Takes incredible guts to make this climb. Just a step too slow. Take your time, enjoy it. Boom! Before the fist draw on your face. Seth Rollins' chances are whittling down, and Rollins in need of salvation. from Rollins. The sprint up the cage is on. Oh, no. He takes control. And every inch climb puts you in a more perilous position. Ooh. Trying to make their way out of the cage. Could not have felt good. STF, STF! Well, this isn't gonna win the fall, but it's gonna do a lot of damage. Their shoulder. Sorry, driver. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. In search of some footing to make this huge climb. He's looking down on the cage from the top. And victory looking more and more likely for him now in this steel cage match. Fought so hard to be in this position, but he's only halfway to victory. He retains the title. Here is your winner, and still, the WWE Champion, The Chosen One, AJ! An always thrilling steel cage match, unpredictable to the very end, but there's the survivor. Seth Rollins can't be pleased with his performance here tonight. He won't be.